Hi everybody, this is Steve, and welcome back to Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Now, we're just uh, wrapping up the game here. Um, I did go and collect, I, I finished the Hippogriff Challenge um, off camera, and I did get a, um, a bunch more of the cards I wanted here. Uh, I'm still not anywhere close to having all of them. Well, I guess I am kind of close, but uh, I don't really care for this uh, playthrough here that I'm doing with everybody um, if we get them all so oh well but anyways we did this uh, portrait last time and the next one was actually just right here any secrets nope Isn't all right I think that was a good password Gazuta. okay nothing on that side Okay, let's go through here. Yeah, I see you fire crab down there. Ooh, good. I needed more of those. I still need uh, more uh, cauldron cakes. I need 30 cauldron cakes to get this very last one. And I'm hoping we'll pick up enough with everything we're doing here. Got him. Okay, excellent. Nothing over here. Nope. Oh, sweet. Oh, I forgot to open that one. No, no, I did. I did open it, and it spit out beans. So I guess it was just another that I got to do twice. All right. Hey, buddy. I know there's one behind me targeting me as well. Told you there was one behind me. All right. That one's taken care of, and now that one's taken care of. Did that open the door? Yes, it did. I had a feeling that was going to happen again. That one's taken care of. And we got... We're getting you. Keep bouncing back towards us. Come on. Come on, fire crab. There we go. We got him. More of the bread. Bread? Bridge. Now builds. Wouldn't surprise me if there was some secrets we were missing off to the sides. It's okay, I can go through that path again later. I didn't like the sound of that. Yes, and another card. I think there's over just over 80, so we're about 20 off. Not too bad. Oh. Okay, I knew I could eventually get through there. All right, that's another portrait done. Let's see. She sells us card, a uh, uh, witch's wizard's card, but I need twenty uh, pumpkin pasties for the next one. And I don't think we had twenty quite yet. I wasn't paying attention though. All right. Uh, yeah, I wasn't paying attention when I picked up the last one to see how many we had. Okay, so we've done those two. I think we did that one right. The second four floor. Well, we'll just make up our way up the floors and check that out as we go. Fourth floor. Uh, fifth floor. First floor. No, we did that one on the first floor. Seventh floor. All right. Well, let's go to... Uh, oh, I do have twenty in, over 20 and 20. Well, next person I see selling them, which there's just a person right up here... Uh, but I want to go this way. Let's uh, swing by the first floor and just check out that portrait, just to make sure. Alright. Yes, we did this one. I do remember this one. Just gonna double check. I remember that, then the Lumos, and the shield guys. Yeah, alright. And then you come back up through there. I remember that. All right, moving on then. I think the next one that we had, I'm just going to pick that up. Um, the next one that we still needed to check was on the fourth floor was the next? Second floor. All right. Hello, second floor. Let's see. I already went in there and did that. Okay. Uh, I think that was the... Ooh. 
Hello. Yeah, I'm fine with another, finding another secret. Ooh. Was, I actually wasn't expecting that. Ah, itchy nose. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. What is down here? Sweet. Anything with those portraits up there? No? Okay. And some more cauldron or er, pumpkin pasties. Fine with that. Cool. Well, that was a fun little secret. Alright. Ah, itchy nose. That's really bugging me today. Okay, so it's a portrait of Hesper Starkey. A table on the second floor. Ah, there you are. Yeah, we definitely haven't done this one yet. Okay, get both of those. And that brought out a Spongify tile. Okay. Let's head up here. Bring it on, little guys. Got those two. That's gonna blow up probably before I get to it. At this point, especially. Go ahead and take you out. Just speed grab that. Gotcha. Oh, yes. Getting everything but cauldron cakes. I need 30. I'm sure I'll pick up more in this. Oh, there's two kinds. I forgot that there was two kinds. Come on, it's all about the angles. Well, I got the one on accident. There we go. Excellent. That's what I'm talking about. Well, we're up to 25. That seems to be it of this one. A couple more, another Witch's and Wizard's card. I'm definitely fine with that. Making some good progress flying through these portraits. Just because I could. Yeah, I had a feeling. If it's one you've already done before, um... It lets you cast a spell again for some reason after you've saved and gotten off, and then get back on. But you don't get anything from them. Oh well. Okay, I think fourth floor, fourth, fifth. Oh yeah, I already did that one on the first. Seventh. So fourth floor, and it's Birdie Bot. Password is Bibble. Oh uh, wait, where did it say? Uh, small chamber. All right. So that's the third floor, and right here is the fourth floor. Have I not really been on the fourth floor? Don't know. Hi, Harry. Over here. Yeah, there's a lot I haven't done here. Let's, uh, oops. Well, I can buy your card now that you're hey, offering brother. to sell me. Interested in buying a collector's card? Of course I am. Maybe not from a Slytherin. Yeah, Bye. I'll take it. There you go, Harry. I actually, uh, when... Oh. I think that was the last card I could buy. Because if, if there was more that I could buy, he would have kept standing there. Alright. Cool. Just beans. Well, fine. I'll take them. I like the beans. What's this way? Might have just been a random save point. It might be where this next portrait brings you out. Who knows? Bibble. Um, it's making noises like it opened and then closed. Bibble. Well, that's weird. Bibble. That's very weird. Bibble. Ah, there we go. Cool. This one seems to be pretty small. Ooh. That was very nice. Hey, I have enough now. Oh, 
Okay. Anything else about this room? Aha! Well, I got me a few more birdie bots every flavor beans. A few more beans. Okay. That was a pretty small room, but it had a lot of goodies in it. Okay. Next one was on the fifth floor. Okay, here we are. And you. What's your story? Derwent Shipling. Uh, tummy Button. Uh, there's some reference about that in the book. Everything in this is related to the actual books. Um, most of the time, anyways. And that one does ring a bell, especially the what the, of the portrait is. Hmm, excuse me. So let's get this other stuff while I'm here. Yeah. Come on, give me the goodies, give me the goodies. So just some more beans. But hey, I'm still fine with that. Tummy button. Did it again. <coughs> Excuse me. Tummy button. There we go. Yeah. That's definitely an older game with some with some glitches. Hey guys. You guys are like my best friends. I'll pick that one up. Yeah, it was getting close to blowing up. You could see it like shaking. Come on, come on, come on. I'd hex you if I could. But it doesn't let you uh, cast magic on those guys. Uh, I think the story is they're immune or something like that is the reasoning behind it. Okay, got all those. Nothing hidden behind those. There's someone to blast that. Ooh, hello. Well, hello, hello, hello. Ooh, I could cast on both of them again. And you keep spitting out pumpkin pasties. I am definitely con er, fine with that. Ah, over the flags. Of course I'd cast spells on the Slytherin. Actually, I think the Slytherins get way more crap than they deserve. I don't think, um, you don't, in the books, you only get a very narrow view of what the Slytherins are like. I don't, I don't think every single Slytherin would have been that way. Oh, well. I mean, you got examples like Slughorn, who was actually a pretty decent fella. I mean, he was greedy and all that, but I think that was more of a family upbringing and whatnot versus, uh, actually being a Slytherin. Awesome, awesome, awesome. When I go up to do that one on the seventh floor, we will buy the last password. In which I could go straight to the end of the game right here, but I want to show off this other stuff. Cool. I was kind of hoping finding that was going to count as a secret. No, I didn't want to open that. Ooh, another portrait over there. And a portrait there. Okay. Whoa, wait a second. This opened up. Cool. Cool little secret. Hmm. Real cool. Alright, so we're on the fifth floor, right? Yes. So the next portrait was on the seventh. Yeah, I only have the two left. Awesome. Okay, we'll take this shortcut to get up to seven, since we're skipping the sixth floor. You, yep, there's no more cards to buy. That was another uh, card seller. Major. Oh, I don't need to go in there yet. I'm going to do this first. Polygot. Let's see, what was your story? I didn't check that. Leopoldina Smethwick. Uh, okay. Something definitely about Quidditch. I think uh, she was a referee. Is the story behind that person. Nothing about those portraits. Alright. Uh, of course I want that cauldron cake. Hello, Pixies. 
glad Ron and Hermione were, Ron and Hermione were able to come with on this one. That's a lot of pixies. Okay. It wouldn't let me untarget the no longer there pixie. But hey, I'm fine with that. Okay, I'm hoping that lifts that gate down there so then I can open the chest. Yep. Oh, it wants me to go that way. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I think Ron got hit by those pixies, so he needed some healing. He needed some love and attention. Whoa! That vomited out a lot of stuff. Cool, cool, sweet, sweet. Aha! I knew there was more to this. This one had a lot of goodies. The trick is just a little shuffle step. Little shuffle step. And then cast. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Awesomest of all the possums. Whoa! That one gave me a couple of cards, or a card at least. All right. That one done. Let's go buy the last password and go check it out. We are flying through this. I think, at least it feels like we're flying through it. Fortuna Major. Fortuna Major. The fat lady. Hi, Fred. Hi, George. Hello. A bit of a mystery, this one, but I'm sure it's worth twice the price. And Ooh. bye. That gives me all the passwords. Again, I could just leave and go beat the game right now. Uh. Oh, now there's a very yep. I think it's actually the Harry Potter card. All right, where are you at? Bridget Wenlock. Ah, sixth, so we are uh, headed to the sixth floor. Snafflejack. If you can collect all the other cards in the set. Okay. The tuna major. All right, getting there, getting there. Hello. Not like I need it right now, but I just can't pass up on it on the secrets. Here we go. Very last portrait. Hmm, probably end up in there. Probably end up in there. Wow, this one's extensive. Okay, so just that side. Okay, yep, that opened the spongified tile. Whee! Who launched me this way? But again, not, not like I needed anything any more of those. Um, there's literally nothing more I need to buy in the game. I can't buy any more of the Witches and Wizards cards. The ones I haven't collected yet are hidden away in secret areas. Um, there's a lot of secret areas on the grounds. Oh, because I'm, I'm in a secret area, so it doesn't show up on the map. But yeah, there's a lot of secret areas um, I have yet to go explore and find across the Hogwarts grounds. Like, these are kind of established areas that you have to find to uh, complete the game. That's okay. Again, not really going for a completion run here. Just going for uh, show you the main part of the game, and then if you guys are interested, I'm sure you can still find this game uh, to buy in places, and it works pretty well, surprisingly, on um, uh, newer computers for being an older game. But then you can go check it out if you're still interested in finding out more, or finding all those other secrets and playing through this adventure yourself. Ah, raining goodies. <laughs> Lots of goodies. That was awesome. Again, just 
collecting because I can. That's probably the one that was dropping the beans. Did it not hit? There it goes. Yeah, I was too far under it. Ooh, nope. More cauldron cakes. Which I think I have more of those than the pumpkin pasties at the moment. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. Last jump. Alright, what did we have hiding? That's a lot of books that I'm having to deal with on my own. That's okay. I destroyed most of them already. Ooh, you almost got me there. Yeah. Whoa. That was pretty good, too. Okay, anything else I can unlock, cast a spell on, get some more last minute goodies. No, nope, that seems to be it. That was uh, somebody poking in to say bye, they were leaving. It's me, Seastar. She cool, she cool. Oh yeah, you guys, uh, at least her voice, seen a picture. She's done a couple of videos with me. Alright, that was it for this secret. Let's get out of here. Ron and Hermione disappeared. They came into this one initially with me. Hello, guys. Alright. That was it. That was all the portraits. I've done all these challenges. Which, that one gave me a headache. Uh, since it's a timed challenge, flying through the rings. Uh, I fin went and found that last Glacius one. And it was the on that right path. Ugh, that I meant to go down to, but I goofed and missed. Um, just missing one, two, three, four, five cards to unlock the bonus card. That is tempting to go looking for him. But it would take me a little while, because I'd have to check out every nook and cranny. Um... I wish this would tell me what secrets I hadn't found yet. Like if there was a secret on that floor. Oh well. Let's go see if they'll just give me that card, bonus card anyways. Sell me more of the cards I'm missing. <laughs> Alright. I, I know they're not, but I'm just doing this Hi, anyways. Hi, George. <coughs> See? Excuse me. We'll Alright. Oh, Fred and George. Ah, I'm so close to getting it. Part of me doesn't want to throw in the towel yet, but I just know it's going to be a bigger headache than it's worth. Major. Yeah, it's going to take me a long time to find all of them. I mean, if I remember right, I think there's some random one portraits is one of the secrets. I don't know why I did this. Uh, actually, I think most of them are on the, on the, the Hogwarts grounds. Though there is one secret somewhere here um, in the school that I have yet to find. But that's okay. See, that was the... I think that's the bean bonus room door. Nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Ah, oh well. Let's go ahead and finish this up. See, I know I... Yeah. Let's just go turn... Let's just go finish this up. I've done the 100% completion before, and it took a lot of work. I don't feel the need to do it again. It's just missing a few cards. Alright. To the Hogwarts grounds. And then to, uh, this way to find Professor McGonagall. Right there. I'm gonna just... 
I didn't do anything with this before, so my curiosity is getting the best of me. Because I don't remember what it's going to do. Ooh, makes a spongified tile appear on the other end. Let's go check it out. Some extra tidbits. Oh, one more card. <laughs> that was interesting. Okay, I did do another thing off camera over here. I'm just going to point out to everybody. This side. There was a little puzzle where I had to go around blasting these. <coughs> Excuse me. And I didn't find out what this is supposed to reveal. I was messing around with this uh, off camera. There's supposed to be an invisible wall somewhere. But again, not certain where. Should be relatively close, too. Before the spell wears off. And it already wore off. <laughs> Whoa, what the? Oh, I thought I saw just like a random card hanging out over here. Beans I don't even need. But yeah, that was where the puzzle was. I jumped on that. It showed which icon, the, like what's on the tiles of the four houses. And I had to go and... Uh, <laughs> and I had to go find and cast a... Uh, the pulso, whatever, on the tiles. Like that. I don't need to do it again. I already did it once. Where is this hidden wall? Alright, now I'm just letting myself get distracted. Let's go just turn this in. Let's go complete this. We're coming, Professor. All right, here we go. Well then, need another look at that achievements list? Here you go. Voila. Completed, 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 completed. Oh, there was nine more cards. I must have miscounted. I don't feel so bad now uh, not doing the full 100%. What? Do I have to have all the cards? Well, if that's the case, I am a dork. Well done. All oh, okay. No, nope, never mind. We're good. Your third year requirements. Splendid work. Absolutely splendid. You should all be very proud of yourselves. What you did for Sirius Black and Buckbeak was truly courageous. Now, do try and behave yourselves during the summer holidays. There we go. There should be an ending cutscene, if I remember correctly. Mm, excuse me, beyond that. Well, it's trying to load something. Though it does show my mouse. I hope the game didn't just crash. Uh, I think the game crashed. Hello? 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 Alright. Well, um... That sucks. Uh, I guess what I'll try to do is I'll try to look up a video of what the ending cutscene is. So you all can see that and I'll just add it on to the end of my video. Um, so if you guys want to watch that, you can. Otherwise, I'll just uh, end it here. So you guys will know if I find it or not, if the video continues uh, after this, or if it just ends. Hopefully I can find a good one of it um, and get that added on. So thanks everybody here for uh, joining me. This was a great game. I love the Harry Potter uh, story, the books, the games, all of it. Um, 
such a, so, something I've really enjoyed since I was pretty young. Um, let's see, I, I found out about the series when it was just the first three books out. I think I was end of elementary. Yeah, long time ago, but that's that's all good. It's something I'll never uh, forget, something I grew up, you know, going on the adventures with Harry, Ron, and Hermione. Um, I hope you guys had just as much fun as I did as I played this game. Uh, definitely my favorite uh, one, a game of the first five. I've never played anything past that. Um, though, yeah, all of them are out. I've watched other people play them. I have a friend who had a couple of the later ones, and so I watched him play a bit. Uh, there was only a couple after anyways. But anyways, that's besides the point. But again, thanks everybody for joining me. I hope you liked this one and the entire series. If you did, please go ahead and click there on that like button. Uh, I do like to see the support, and it lets me know that you guys are liking what I'm doing. If you don't like what I'm doing or just have any feedback for me, please leave your comments below. I do want to hear from you, your comments and uh, what you have to say and all that. Your feedback help me do better, uh, so I do want to hear from you. Uh, in the meantime, though, I will see you later. As the Hogwarts Express carried him and his friends back to King's Cross Station, Harry recalled something Professor Dumbledore had said. You think the dead we loved ever truly leave us? You think that we don't recall them more clearly than ever in times of great trouble? Your father is alive in you, Harry, and shows himself most plainly when you have need of him.